Hello everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel. So today we're going to be doing something different. So I'm going to be doing your ranking of all the Taylor Swift Volt track. Instead of me like ranking all of it, why not? I'll just do like tier ranking because it's a lot more interesting and it's, I don't know, less boring and something different and I haven't done this in like so long on my channel. I did a Disney like movie one so Swifties might kill me for some of my taste but that's just my taste. So let's play along down below. I'll give you the link to if you want to do this, you know, ranking yourself too. And Speak Now is here so for the do, let's get right into it. I have like 20 minutes to film this video before I have to go somewhere. So I'm gonna have the screen over here. I don't know how I'm gonna edit this. Hey, so we have Iconic, it's a bop, it's okay, it's been better, it's a no. So, I can't believe the Voltrack is like so, you know, tiny. It's like, red has so many red. Well, I'll get into which, which three re-recordings that I like for Voltrax, but let's get. Okay, so the first one is on the list is All the Girls You Loved Before. Oh my god, this is from Lover, in case you've been living under a rock. This is, um, I'm leaning towards bop or iconic. I'm gonna put bop. It's a bop. I love that song. It's a bop. You're losing me. Oh, you're losing me is how I was feeling back in spring with finishing, you know, university and stuff, saying goodbye or like losing friends from uni. That's a different story for another day. And Taylor is the queen of like, she's writing this song about me, even though it's a breakup. So this is obviously iconic. Iconic. I, I'm waiting for it to be released on streaming. Whenever that's going to be. <clears throat> but okay, you all over for me. You all over by uh, Maureen Morris. I'm gonna put, it could have been better. I wish Merlin Morris is not a backup. I wish she just does has a verse. I don't like when they do duets. Duet is actually just a background vocal. I wish she had a verse. I mean, at least when she did the surprise song with her, she had a verse. I wish we got in that version instead of her lurking, but it's a great song, but it could have been better. Mr. Perfectly Fine. Ooh, I love the message. It's like, it depends on my mood. I get what the song is. And I'm gonna put, it's a bop, it's a bop. It's a bop. This is a perfect climb. It's a bop for me. So I'm going to put in that one. We were happy. Um, it does have a catchy chorus, but I do love everything after Mr. Perfectly Fine. So I'm going to put, it's okay. I'll put it's okay. That's when. I love that's when. And it's going to put, it's almost there. So I'm, I'm going to put, it's a bop. It's a bop. That's when. It's a bop. I'm going to put, it's a bop. Don't you. Oh, I love don't you too. Don't you. Don't you smile at me and ask me how. I'm saying it, so it's a bop. It's not in that iconic, like, top tier. It's, like, almost there. So I'm going to put don't you. Bye-bye, baby. I'm going to put it's okay. It's okay. It took me a while to, you know, love that song. It took me lots of, like, re-listening to that song. Yes. It took me a while. Okay. So now we're in the speak now track. Oh my god, I did my, um, TikTok. I think I put it on my YouTube, like, the my, um, ranking. I'm very shocked that it's only six full tracks. But it doesn't matter how much, let's, but some of the songs are, like, so long. They're, like, almost five minutes each. So, Electric Touch by featuring Fallout Boys. Um, I feel like it's a generic song that I heard from, from so many songs. This is a great, like, again, the TV, Speak Now TV has so many great, like, rom-com I could hear in the end credits. I'm gonna put, it's okay. It's okay. It's an okay song. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. When Emma falls in love. Oh my god. It's not okay. It's a bop. bop. I love that song. And it's a bop. So I'm gonna put it's a bop. I might. We'll see how we're doing with time. I can see you. I love the music video so much. The music made me love this song. So I'm gonna put it's iconic. It's iconic. I love that song. I can see you. It's iconic. It's an iconic track. Oh my god. Castle Crumbling. Haley um, Williams. I'm sorry if I. I know Haley from Paramount. It's iconic. I. Oh, I mean, I'm leaning towards either it's iconic or it's a bop. I'm gonna go with it's a bop. No, it's iconic too. I love the message of that song. Uh, pretty self-mandatory. It's like everything you build is all falling down. And this is for like, this is me trying. Mirabal, um, breadwinner girlies. So I'm gonna put iconic. I love that song. I love that song. I love it. Foolish one. Oh my god. I love the song too. I feel like it's about me. So I'm gonna put it's a bop. It's a bop. I love Foolish One. It's a bop. Timeless. Um, it's okay. I'm gonna put it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I just feel like, I feel like it's like the sister of Mar- I'm sorry if I say her name wrong. It's, um, not Marjorie. Marjorie? Mar- 
um, her Taylor Swift's grandma from the Evermore song. It's the sequel for that one. I feel like I should have watched the lyric video instead of me just listen to it because like it's a very small song. It's a great like timeless love story. She, again, she's very great at love story. I love seeing old pictures of her grandma is gorgeous. She is so pretty. So she it's okay. It's okay, Trash. I'm being nice. Better man. Ah, uh, it's okay. It's okay. Maybe it would have been better if it was like female duet instead of her singing it. It's okay. I will put it's okay. Nothing new. Oh my god. Easy. Iconic. It's an iconic song. This is my depression song. This is everybody's depression song. It's an iconic song and I love that song. Babe. It's a bop. It's a bop. Especially the bridge. Since you admitted it, I can picture it. See, like that. Iconic. Message in the bottle. Another iconic song. Such an iconic song. I love that song. It's like, I'm like, whoa, what is, how is Red like a 1989? It's like, so many bops. Oh my god. I bet you think about me. It's a bop. It's a Bob song. This is like sister to speak now, as some people would say. Forever Winter. Um, I I'm gonna put, it could have been better. I just wish that Taylor would make it more sad. I love, I, I heard the original demo of this song. I found that it was a lot more sadder than what it was released. I feel like she could have made it more sad. A little bit upbeat, but that with the violin. I don't know. I feel like she could have done that track a lot better. Run. Sorry. It's a no. It's a no for me. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't know for me. First, all too well. Well, all too well will obviously be iconic. But anyway, the very first night. I'm gonna put, you know what? I'm gonna be generous. I feel like I'm gonna put this, it's it's an iconic track. I. It's a great song to play after, you know, a girl's hangout. Why is all too well not in here? This is Tim and Rich, but you know. So it's, you know, it's a very first night. It's a cute song. I don't know, it's a very nostalgic song. I really love the song. I hope she plays it when, we, when I see her in LA. So anyway, so let me just rank it. Let's do it icon first. I'm gonna put nothing new a little bit higher. So it would go with I'm gonna switch. So you're losing me is number one. This is the ranking. Nothing new. Um and it, I think this is accurate. Yes. Number one is you're losing me. Nothing new. Third is I can see you. And then fourth is castle crumbling. And the very first night. That's you know number five. Okay, it's a bop. I mean I have so many it's a bop. Some of them it like could have been iconic. Okay, um, don't you would definitely be- Ah, sorry. Babe, I think she could have been- Well, it depends on my mood. I love all the girls you loved before. Um, foolish one. I think those TikTok, um, wait, no, 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 no. This is so hard. Bob, making the Bob ranking is hard. Depends on my mood. Um, okay. Okay, this is accurate. Okay, so number one will definitely be all the boy- All the- All the girls you love. I won't say all the boys you loved before, but all the girls you loved before. That's when, number two- Foolish one, just how I feel. Number four is Mr. Perfectly Fine. Message in the bottle, when Emma falls in love, don't you, I bet you think about me and babe. Babe, sorry babe. I think this is eight. Oh my god, eight. This is like literally half of the track. Okay, it's okay. Um, We're happy, bye-bye. Let me change this. Uh, no. Okay, so when we're happy is number one. Electric touch, and then timeless. Bye-bye, baby. And then better man is... Kind of it's easy. You're you all over me and forever winter. And then lastly, it's run down the comments down below. Those are my rankings for all the vote tracks. And I made like you know, if we put a picture over here, it's probably already there. Below in the comments, what which one is your ranking for the Tales of all the vote track? Let me know in the comments below what you think and what's your um okay. So this is my ranking for for vote track so far. I feel like red is number one for me, and then it's going to be fear. I'll go with speak now, and then fear is last for I think it's just on top of my head I might change it I mean it depends on my mood I think this feels accurate I think this is what I'm putting on the universe so red is obviously number one red has great vault tracks and speak now and then fearless is oh sorry fearless I still love you fearless I still love you let me comment what you think and I'll see you all on my next video hope you enjoyed this short video thank you guys so much and I'll see you all on the next video okay bye oh I can't believe that's her oh wait that's it okay